If you're new here, like and subscribe. I'm Amanda. If you're not new here, then thanks for coming back. Today I am doing my November empties. They're in a Wawa bag. Because <laughs> I didn't have any other bag to put them in right now. So I'm going to try to not make crinkly noise. I'm going to dump them out. Okay, so the first empty I have is my St. Ives Blackhead Clearing Green Tea Scrub. Now I, it's, I've had it for over a year. I think that it works really good and I used it all the time, but it's not like the best in the world. But I really did like it. I don't think I was using it to the extent I was supposed to because I wasn't washing my face correctly until Karen and Renee taught me how to. My skin's actually starting to look a little better. I mean, I still got like a couple little, this one's been here forever, like weeks, cause I didn't want to pop it. And this one too. I don't want to talk about pimples when I'm doing empties. <laughs> Alright, but yeah, the St. Ives Blackhead Clearing. I would buy it again because I know how to use it now. And it worked on me before pretty good. The Not Your Mother's Beach Babe Texturizing Dry Shampoo. I would buy this again. I got it from Ulta. It smells great. It works great. I love dry shampoo because I can't wash my hair every day. Too busy. I'm a busy mama. Bethany. Uh... A Pearlie's Blue Lotus 4-in-1 Cleansing Milk. I love this stuff, uh, but it doesn't bubble up or anything because it's cleansing milk. But I did like it. I used it too fast. I'd say it lasted me about a month. Next one is the H2O Hydration Oasis Nourishing Gel Cream. I did like this, but I would not purchase the full size. But I do love these little samples of it because I get a good, like, six seven uses out of it maybe more and it does work good but i have face moisturizers that i like more the coconut milk hair oh all this stuff where did i get it Duh. i got these from ipsy i get a lot of things from ipsy i don't get ipsy anymore though a lot of these empties will be from ipsy the coconut milk hair mist with vitamin e by soap box i loved this stuff i use most of it on my daughter and it smells great. Like, great. I love it. There's actually a little bit left in there. Dump it in my hand. and So my hair smells good. I know, I'm a silly. But you can't waste that smell because that smells like so good if you love coconut. I would buy it if I seen it. But I don't know how much the full size even is. Okay, the next ones are from my Renee. They are... Let me make sure I got them all together. All um, the Avon samples that I've used. I still have a couple left because I didn't want to run out. I used a new Platinum Night and the Day Cream and the Serum, but I forgot to save the other ones. And I really, 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 really love this stuff, but it's expensive, so I can't buy it. But I do love it. The Belief True Cream. They actually had this in Ipsy once. People didn't even notice it was from Avon. <laughs> I like it. I do. I still have a sample in this drawer. No, I have two samples. The Avon A New Vitamin C. Also a goodie. It's empty. Oh, I'm sorry. I was looking to see if there's more left. The first and free 150 milligram CBD cream every day. Now, honestly, I don't even remember if this worked. So that means that I would not buy it. I got it from Pinch Me. Next, I also got from, well, I got this from Ulta, from a sampler thingy from like September that I got. It's Blonde Ale Dry Bar. And it didn't work good enough for me to notice if I liked it. But I think I'd try it again because it's Dry Bar. So it must have been okay, right? Okay, so the Sir Medic Azulin Soothing Cream. Jess Gus by Sir Medic, Sir Medic. Jessica has sent me this, so I don't know where she got it. Next, oh, there's another Belief True Cream. The Smith & Colt Locked and Lit, Locked and Lit CBD Lip Balm. I want a full size of this more than all my empties, other than this perfume one that I have. 
Uh, well, I think I'd take this over it. But this, I love the smell of it and the texture. And even if it had no CBD in it, I would still want it. And I'm sad that I ran out. I ran out yesterday. This is a sample, though. It's expensive. <laughs> okay, the Bare Mineral Skin Longativity Long Life Herb Serum. I got this from Pinch Me. Very happy to have a sample from them. Don't know if it did a difference or not on me. Okay, next I got from Karen. Good Molecules Niacinamide Brightening Toner. Wasn't big on it. It's kind of weird. There's another toner that she gave me that I'm getting low on. I think it's a car brand, and I actually like it. Oliviana Men on One Body Wash. Hubby used that because I got him two birch boxes, so he let me get him, and I think he liked it. I'm not sure. I have to ask him. But he didn't complain. Okay. I got this from a giveaway hard candy mattifying primer. I liked it for being hard candy brand. It's definitely good for being affordable. So yes, I would buy this if I didn't have money for primer and this is all I could afford. Yes, yes, here it is. I might be crazy today. Marcel BB Cream. I've had a couple of these from Birchbox. I recommend it, I like it. The Koki Be Bright Concealer. I had this forever and ever. The company's actually made in my state. Well, the whatever, the factory or whatever. And I had this for a year from Birchbox. Now Ipsy has it, but this one was from Birchbox and I would buy it. All right, last thing, my dream fragrance. I had this in my purse forever. It's from Ipsy and it smells so good. It's like $100 a bottle. It's like, it's empty. But it's Dream Fragrance. I love it. $100 a bottle is crazy. I would pay $50. This perfume's expensive. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed my empties video. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And keep kindness in your heart. Love you guys. It's totally something I would do. I was sitting on four empties. Because I dumped them in my lap. But I guess it just fell down the crack of my legs. And, you know. The Kiss of May. <laughs> I'm sorry. The Kissame Pure Vitamin C Primer. I like this stuff. It was very good. Not my favorite, 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 but in top six, maybe. But I do like it. I do, do, do. I can't really. Kissame. And then the Pearlese Daily Lip Nourisher with Mango and Shea Butter. I would never buy this again because I didn't like it. It didn't do anything special for me. And when it went bad, I put it on my lips and it was all clunky and I almost threw up. And my daughter was laughing. It was that funny. And there's actually some left in there. Oh, gross. The Murad Renewing Eye Cream. I think I got this from Tammy. I got the Kiss and May from Ipsy and the Pearlies from Ipsy. The Murad Eye Cream I got from Tammy Beauty Tutorials. And I could really feel it working and doing something. I would buy it if I could afford it. The same with this one, the Pie All Day Hydration. I got this from Birchbox, Love and Hype. I love it. I did, I did. All right guys, I'm done now, okay? Love you. And we'll grow in number, fueled by thunder.